Hey, what's up guys? This is KD Cloudy and if you're a student or an employee, chances are that you're working with PDF files a lot and working with PDFs can be a little frustrating at times because you can directly edit them or make changes or annotate or mark them up or, you know, do conversions or have control over your PDF. Uh, so if you're one of them, this video is perfect for you and good news. Uh, today's sponsor is Wondershare and Wondershare has recently launched their software PDF element into the iOS app store. So you can now mark up your documents and convert all your PDFs and do whatever you want with them on the go with your iPhone or your iPad. And in this video, I'll be walking you through some of the features offered by PDF element pro for iOS and yeah, right from installation to marking up, converting, editing your PDF documents and saving them. Everything is covered in this video. So yeah, let's just jump into it. So firstly, with the installation process, it's pretty simple. Just grab your iPhone or iPad and open up the app store. Just search for PDF element and you'll find it right over there. You just need to download it and install it. So once you have installed and have PDF element pro up and running, like I have on my iPad mini, you can open it. And once you open it, you have a few options and you can either scan new documents, load up documents from the photo library or browse an existing PDF from the files app. I'll do just that. Okay. So now once we have loaded up a file over here, we can do different things to organize it. We have different views to take a look at all of the pages, a few different modes. Now the main features lie in these three buttons. First is the markup button and you can do various things like this annotate, add text, highlight, and I'll use the trusty Apple pencil for this. I can circle stuff, make arrows, scroll, no problem. And I can even highlight things, which is pretty excellent. Moreover, I can add legit text boxes, apply all sorts of formatting, and I can even add call outs, notes, shapes, all sorts of cool stuff. And also these cool stamps. And that's pretty amazing. And I can even remove and erase all of this if I don't like something. So that's also very nice. But the most important feature is this text editing. Often it's very frustrating to not being able to edit PDFs just like that. But PDF element fixes exactly that. Using this, we can edit text, add anything. And with iPad OS 14, you can use the Apple pencil to scribble what you want to write. It's actually pretty cool. Next, you can even add images to your document camera roll and place it anywhere. Like I have these giant pair of AirPods. I mean, for no reason at all, but yeah, that's pretty cool as well. So yeah, that's basically it. Those were all of the major features of PDF element pro. And as you might've noticed, it's a pretty solid alternative to Adobe Acrobat and also much less expensive. And you can pretty much get it for all platforms, all the major platforms out there, uh, Mac, iOS, windows. Uh, Android. So that's pretty good. All the details to get it, install it, download it. Everything is down below in the description. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much to Wondershare for sponsoring this video and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Cheers.